What's going on guys? It's your boy Kim. Today I'm about to go on a fishing trip for you guys. I know I've been on a couple fishing trips and you guys haven't been able to watch it, but this time I'm taking you guys along with me. I got my chest strap uh, ready, so I'm gonna have that on while I fish so you guys will be able to see what I'm seeing. So, yeah, I'm just gonna put my... Go to Walmart real quick, pick up some new lures, and then head out. And hopefully, catch a fish on camera for you guys. I haven't been to um, my local lake for a while since it, since the drought that we had in California. So hopefully the the water the water levels up, and I can fucking hammer some fucking fish. So uh, let's hope. Just keep on praying that they have some good shit in there. Right now I'm just holding my chest strap mount because I didn't want to take it off and put it on my uh, mini tripod that I have right now. So, as I open my fucking thing, smack it, grab my wheel. Yeah, we're pretty much we're out of here, man. We're about to go, um, go to Walmart see the lures that they have uh, go get some gas and then yeah head out to my to Lake Paris um, it's 10 bucks to get in so it's not too bad but uh hopefully you know I can catch some fish while I'm in there and I'll take you guys on my little adventure so stay tuned guys but I just want to show you guys my car real quick while it's warming up, what I've done to it. It's a little dirty at the moment. But uh, I traded in my Avids and I got some I got some JNCs. Um, they were pretty, a couple of them are pretty beat up with uh, really bad um, curb rashes. Like this one is pretty bad, not too bad. Curb rash all the way around. And then uh, curb, like really bad indenting indentations right here and what else yeah and this wall this one's a really bad one right here as you can see they whoever had this the previous really fucked up like big dance you know but uh i wanted a new look so i was willing to trade tires were beat up too and i want to show you guys the hard top that i got Picked it up for eight fifty from a friend. He held it for me for about two, three weeks. So um, yeah, I was pretty hyped that he held it for me. But uh, I had an altercation where I had to remove the stickers, and it looks like either the, the heat has cracked it or something. Yeah, it looks like looks like when I took off the sticker, the heat has uh, warped the plastic a lot. But yeah, it's a. Uh, pretty clean it needs a new paint job as you can tell it was red and it was like red and white underneath but he painted it it's been riveted in so it's it's plastic instead of glass so weight reduction JDM I uh, still got my exhaust that's melting the fuck out of my bumper oh wow. and I installed my uh, rear um, what do you call it spacers and I, I roll the fenders with a exhaust pipe. That's why my paint's all chipped right here. And it's still scraping just a little bit right here. I think it's towards the back. Not too sure. But still rubbing somewhere. I gotta jack it up, pound it in more with the hammer. But uh, overall, the car's looking really nice. I like the little flare that I, we did with the exhaust piping. Like We actually did a pretty good job. I don't think I should have been I should have rolled it this far out, but um, yeah. it fits the front look and uh, it looks pretty cool. I can, I can probably go lower if I want to just be slammed, you know, slam life. And I got my tow hook, tow hook dragon. It's already ripped. Look at it. That's how low I am, guys. But yeah, so I'm gonna head out of Walmart right now and uh, I'll catch you guys in a bit. I'll show you guys my interior in, uh, right now. What the fuck? I just looked down my hood and look what someone drew. Nice. 
<laughs> nice. I don't. I really don't know who drew that. I think it was at the park yesterday. Someone, someone drew that. But what the fuck? But yeah. Um. Yeah. This is my interior. I don't think you guys have really seen it that well. So I got my eBay fake not fake a sparkle quick release and with the eBay hub um, I got a eBay short shifter with this custom crown royal boot that's kind of dirty and shit and she yeah, short shifter I got the Amazon um, bracket or whatever you call this I got my um, Kenwood uh, detachable you know um stereo and pretty much everything else is pretty much everything else is stock in here see i got the mounts right here and actually this car didn't come with the side strikers it didn't, it didn't come with this but it was on a uh, it was on jordan's car because i guess his car came usually when people have this on the car came uh OEM hardtop. So Jordan actually had a hardtop, but it didn't come with it. It came with a soft top. I guess the owner converted it. So yeah, I had to drill some holes or cut some holes in to fit that bra that mounting thing, and now it clicks in. So yeah, I'm hoping to get um some uh what do you call it? the Garage Star Garage Star um hardtop mount. So yeah. Look at that Asian boy. That's my nephew. So yeah, I'm gonna head out right now to Walmart. So I'll catch you guys in a little bit. All right, guys. Oh my God. Every time I look at that hood, it just looks so funny. Just got out of Walmart right now. And I'm gonna head towards uh, Lake Parish right now. So yeah, I'll see you guys there. And hopefully we'll catch some fish for you guys. decent size lake. I don't know if I'm supposed to park here because of these long lanes. I feel like it's for the boats. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna park right here and uh, let's see if we can catch some fish. I'm gonna try to fish that that um what do you call it dam wall area towards the dam and hopefully there's fish in the, in the area. So I'm gonna attach my um my little mount that I have here and uh, see you guys in a little bit. So yeah guys, this is the setup that I'm going to be running right now. Got my rod right here. I should get a cover for my guides because I'm just fucking up this cheap rod that I bought. But yeah, I got an outcast rod, Shakespeare outcast rod with a Shakespeare agility. This is like on rollback for like 30 bucks at um Walmart, so I, so I bought it. Right now we're going to tie on some lures and head out and go fishing. So... I'm gonna get my battery and shit off of here. Put this in my thingy. This is the lures that I got. So as you guys know, I just started bass fishing. So I don't have the biggest, you know, setup. But I think I'm gonna fish this little jig that I got right here and hope we can catch some fish with this. Just swim it off the bottom. Um, yeah. So, 
Like I said, I'm not the best fisherman, but I did catch two fish yesterday. And I didn't film it, and I apologize for that, guys. But, uh, you know, shit happens. Um, I'm going to buy a couple more poles, different, um, different ratio um, reels. So I'm going to get one for crank cranking. This one's a medium heavy rod. So this one is for, what is medium heavy for? I was looking at videos earlier today. Medium heavy with a six to three ratio. So I'm trying to find a versatile rod. This one's pretty decent. I want more of a fast uh, action. Snip this off. We're ready to go fishing, man. Let's go. So after that, I might fish my baby bass, spotted bass, or some um, my crankbaits. I actually got some more crankbaits. Let's see what else I got. It's on sale at Walmart. I got a frog, actually. So I should be uh, fishing this with a braid, but I don't got braid, so fish the frog. Got some more hooks. And some dollar um, yum soft plastics. That's going in my soft plastic bag with all my other lures. Oh, I got another one in here. I gotta add this. This is a deep diving crankbait, a little small one. See, I need lighter, um, a softer reel. No, softer, I mean, um, softer uh, tip for these little crankbaits that I got and I got a, a shallow um, silver uh, another drift bait so you know god this thing's wide open what the fuck gotta be, gotta be careful with these things they're sharp so add that this is all trash throw it in here for now but we're going to go head out real quick. I'll catch you guys in a little bit when I start walking down and get towards the lake. So I'll catch you guys in a bit. 